Welcome to another Ecological Niches video. Today we'll be talking about the niche that elk occupy in their ecosystem. Elk, also known as wapiti, are one of the largest species of deer in the world. These majestic animals can be found in parts of North America from Alaska to Mexico. Elk are herbivores, meaning that they only eat plants. They feed on a variety of vegetation, including grasses, leaves, bark, and twigs. They are able to consume large quantities of food each day, which makes them an important part of the food chain in their ecosystem. Elk have a unique relationship with predators, such as wolves and bears. These animals are able to hunt and kill elk, which provides them with a food source. However, the presence of predators also has an impact on the behavior of the elk. Elk are able to detect the presence of predators through their sense of smell and hearing. When they sense danger, they will often run away from the area to avoid being attacked. This behavior has a positive impact on the ecosystem and helps to prevent overgrazing in certain areas. Elk also play an important role in the aquatic system. They are known to spend a lot of time near rivers and streams, which can have a positive impact on water quality. Their hooves help to break up the soil, which can improve water retention and reduce erosion. Additionally, their grazing habits can help to keep invasive plant species in check, which can have a positive impact on the overall health of the ecosystem. However, when elk are left unchecked, they can also have a negative impact on the aquatic ecosystems by overgrazing plants along the stream edge. This overgrazing can lead to the destabilization of the banks and increase erosion. Elk also have an impact on the forest around them. They are known to feed on young saplings, which can prevent forests from becoming too dense. This can be beneficial for other plant and animal species that rely on a more open forest canopy. Additionally, elk are known to rub their antlers against trees, which can cause damage to the bark. While this may seem like a negative impact, it can actually be beneficial for certain species of birds and insects that rely on the dead and decaying trees for habitat. Finally, elk have an impact on the grassland system. Their grazing habits can help to promote the growth of new vegetation, which can be beneficial for other herbivores that rely on the grassland for food. Additionally, elk are known to create wallows, which are shallow depressions in the ground that they use to roll in. These wallows can create areas of bare ground, which can be beneficial for certain plant species that require more open habitat and disturbances. In conclusion, elk are an important part of the ecosystem in which they live. They can play a key role in the food chain. Their behavior can have a positive impact on the overall health of the ecosystem. From their impact on the aquatic and forest systems to their grazing habitats in the grasslands, elk are a crucial part of the natural world. Thanks again for watching another Ecological Niches video. If you want to learn more, click on one of the links here and click subscribe for more videos. Once again, thank you very much and we'll see you in the next video.